Всем привет! Вы на канале Матком ТВ и мы решили повторно пройти The Five Dates. В этот раз мы выберем других девушек и будем другим персонажем. Попробуем. Нет, яркость тоже. Оказывается, можно играть при помощи контроллера. Мне кажется, это будет куда удобнее. Кем же мы будем? Я думаю, мы будем... Теперь это мы немножко знаем о Вине. Мы будем вот с этой фоточкой. С его приятелем. Хм... Я буду медиком. Так, чем у нас увлекаются медики? Тусовочками, едой и фитнесом. Не хочу умереть от чего-то нехорошего. А вот знак здека оставлю своим. Have you actually just woken up? <laughs> yeah. Well, key workers don't really have a choice. It's been, it's been really, really intense to be honest. I can imagine, man. Honestly, you have been putting in a shift, mate. My hero. Relax. Honestly, mate, I'm swooning. I think I've got a semi right now. Okay. <laughs> anyway, listen, listen, listen. Before I need, I need to tell you something. I have, I'd say, just a little bit of a surprise for you. Oh, go on then. I joined a dating app. No way! <laughs> hey, this is huge, bro. Listen, I was all alone in my <laughs> flat. With... <laughs> I was all alone in the flat with nothing else to do, and I just thought, why not? You know what? I'm hearing that digital dating is popping off during lockdown. You know? Have you got any video dates yet? No, I literally just joined. Okay. Hey, Vin. Hey, Vin. Seriously, yeah. No joke. Your profile needs to be on. Point, yeah? And then, when you're looking at these girls' profiles, <laughs> there's a few things you need to watch out for. You need to look at the angles that they're using to take the pictures and that, yeah? Because they're, they're going to deceive you. Callum, I have I have talked to girls before. I do understand what you're doing. I have talked to girls before. Okay. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait, hold on. I just got a notification. Uh, no way. It looks like I got beginner's luck. Oh, you sexy... Bastard, bruv. Yes. Yes. <laughs> I've got some matches. All right, man. Let me know how it goes, bro. Peace. All right, cool, man. Bye-bye. Так, Шейна. Здравоохранение. Привет, коллега. Пейдж. А, видимо, как-то занята со спортом. И... А вот, кстати, Грейс мы плохо изучили. И Грейс. looking pen, bro. Tasty. I've got three video dates scheduled back to back. Okay, show off. No, 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 not really. I've, I've never been on a digital date before. I don't know what I'm doing. Uh, just treat it like a real life date, I guess. You know, people seem to be really enjoying them as well. Okay, and is this a good setup? I've got this right. Uh, you know what? I don't think you should have the bed in the back like that, man. Sends out the wrong message. Okay, I'm definitely moving into the living room. Okay. Oh, trying to look like a slut. Ugh. Oh, Vinny. My intention. Vinny, we've spoken about this. It's, it's, it's just wrong, man. It's wrong. 
Now, you want to find a spot where the natural light is hitting your face, kind of like it's hitting mine and making me look so goddamn beautiful. And also, what you want is eye level. Set the camera to eye level, bro. Not low angle or high angle. They are not flattering. Okay, I think this is a good spot. Uh, let's get that fireplace yeah. looking nice in the back. Okay, maybe have a couple more things. I really am so hurting. Oh yeah, okay, I got like a trophy from when I was a kid. Ah, yeah, show her that you're a winner. Yeah, and culture, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay, I think we're I think we're ready. Oh, should I drink? It is your call entirely, mate. Oh, the worst thing though is if you're drinking and the other person isn't. I'm so nervous. Um I need some beers. Get some beers. Go on then. Okay. Cheers. Cheers. Okay, wish me luck, yeah? I hope it goes terribly. Honestly, you are the bestest friend I've ever had. No, nah, I'm joking. Listen, listen. You are going to smash this date, yeah? And you jump on all confident like, and you say her first name straight away. Straight away, straight in, smiling. Show them all your teeth. Okay. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. Show no. them all the teeth. Oh my goodness. Okay, I think the first one's about to start. Hey, go well, lad. Okay. All right. Cool. Listen, I'll uh, I'll debrief you after. I'll let you know how it goes. Peace, boy. All right. Peace. I'm gonna click on this. Okay. Bye. Cool. Uh huh. <laughs> hey, oh. you're right, you're right. <laughs> Hi there. Uh, go on, uh, sorry, ladies first. Um, hi, um, I'm Shayna. <laughs> Shayna, nice to meet you. I mean, at least we're both a similar level of punctual. Yeah, and I was worried I was going to be late. I hadn't really figured out how to use this data now. Join the club. I just downloaded this thing this morning, so... Mm. Um, so, uh, I don't think it's wrong, but you're from up north, right? Yeah, good, good spot. Um, from Leeds. Okay, but your your profile said that you live in London. Yeah, no, I do. Um, my parents moved down here a couple of years ago to be closer to their parents. So yeah, but needless to say, the house was a bit of a downsize. One second, sorry, 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 one second. That's no, all right. You go ahead. Hanji. Meiji. Okay. Sorry, sorry. Yeah, it's um, okay. You didn't hear that, did you? Literally not a word. Well, well, was it about me? God, no, I don't tell my parents about guys that I'm talking to on dating apps. Oh, wait, so you're living with your parents during lockdown? But you're, you're a frontline nurse. How, how is that working? It's not ideal, but um, I could have gone to a hotel, but I thought I needed to be closer to them to make sure that they were all right. Yeah. I kind of just self-isolate. I come in through the back and then just come straight to my room. OK, so no contact whatsoever, basically? Nope. Just nice. that shouting that you heard. <laughs> <laughs> How about you? Um, you work in healthcare, don't you? How's it for you? Yeah, I do, but um, it's sort of easier for me because I live alone. And how are the hours for you? I mean, uh, preaching to the choir here, but horrific some days. But that's what we're here for, right? This is um, this is the first day off I've had in, I don't know, like about four or five weeks. You're joking. Well, listen, I. Thank you for choosing to spend some of it with me. Likewise. So this living at home situation, how long has that been going on for? Um, forever. OK. <laughs> yeah, no, I, I really get on with my family and, well, I'm actually just saving up for my own place and, well, like, for in London and on a nurse's wage, that is just it's going to take me forever, so... Yeah, so I'm living here for the foreseeable future. But listen, I just have to say amen to it because, yeah. But how is the saving going? It... Really, really, really well, really well. Um, I might just be able to afford a cosy cupboard. Uh, <laughs> but I'm actually quite good at saving. I just I just like the odd luxury, like anyone else. Ooh, OK. Such as? Such as uh, trainers. I'm always on my feet all day, so I like a comfy kick. No, it makes sense. If you're walking around loads, and listen, you have to, I feel like you have to spend your money on something. You've got to enjoy it somehow, especially 
you working probably incredibly hard, so. I mean, I've got loads. <laughs> so, you live on your own, right? Yeah. Are you renting or do you own it? Well, sorry, either way, it looks really nice. From the bit I can see. You like, <laughs> you, from the bit you can see, you like. Yeah, the bit you've tidied up <laughs> for this, it looks really good. <laughs> this place is so extortionate, though. I mean, my, my landlord's eased up on the rent during lockdown, but it just eats into my bank account every month. I don't know how you do it. Like, all my friends have the same issue at your age. Like, the struggle is real. I won't be able to do it. Hats off to you. Yeah, it's... Again, I'm just... Some people don't have a roof over their head right now. No. And so, I mean, I'm one of the lucky ones, regardless, so... It's true. You know. So, I figured I'd just address the elephant in the room. There's an elephant? Well, hopefully I'm the only one that can see it. How do you feel about the cougar sitting opposite you being three years your senior? <laughs> OK, uh, it genuinely makes no difference to me. What about you? No, it's no problem on my end. As long as you're mature and you're not expecting a sugar mama. <laughs> OK, no, no, that's reasonable. No. Have you ever dated someone older? Or, like, what age range do you actually date if there is one? You're delving in here, aren't you? Uh, gosh, I haven't really... I don't think I've considered it too much. I have, actually. Um, so it's kind of nothing out of the ordinary for me. Can I ask why it hasn't worked out? No, sorry, sorry, is that, sorry, is that too, sorry, is that too direct? No, no, not sorry. at all. No, not at all, straight to the point. I, I like that. Um, gosh, these questions are tough. <laughs> Making you think. Sometimes relationships, they just run their course, you know? Mm-hmm, yeah, no, I hear you. It's like, no one's fault. Just, just naturally happens, I guess. Bingo, yeah. It wasn't out of malice or, I mean, hopefully they weren't seeing other people. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, um, but yeah, just things just tend to fizzle out. I mean, that's kind of been my experience so far. Um, yeah, hopefully sense. I can change that in the future. But yeah. Any time will tell. Yeah. <laughs> Dinner. Dinner. Um, Dinner. Sorry. Dinner. One second, sorry. It's all right, go for it. She talked about for a while. <laughs> <laughs> right, uh, where was he? Okay, sorry for the chat escalating so quickly. Oh, no, my goodness, that's all right. Small talk is boring anyway. I just think it's stuff that should be out in the open, you know, from the very start for both of us. So now, now, look, now you can interrogate me as you see fit. <sighs> okay, all right, I won't do that. I'm not going to grill you, but there are a couple of things that I was wondering. One thing in particular. Okay, go for it. Sort of stepping outside of the work world, how do you spend your downtime? Downtime? What? What is downtime? You're asking the wrong person. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right, okay. Uh, when I do get a moment, I... Okay, video games are my guilty pleasure. No way. Are you serious? Big time. My, um, my best friend Callum loves to play video games. I bet you've probably even killed him a couple of times online. I probably actually have as well. I'm quite good. <laughs> <laughs> I know it's really dorky, yeah, it's really dorky. Are you a gamer? I just love, you know, the escapism or, like, the feeling of achieving a, like, a completing a 50-hour RPG or... Or actually, do you know what? I just love getting the highest on a multiplayer online. <laughs> I, def I dabble, but I'm definitely not on the same level as you, for sure. No, I actually wouldn't expect many people to be on the same level as me. I know it's proper dorky. I know it's so dorky. Oh, okay. Wow. So you're also quite cocky as well. Is that like a, this is a trait that I'm... Sort of, sorry. Just, just come... I'm actually quite good, so it sort of makes sense to be cocky. Yeah, <laughs> to be cocky because you can back it up with your word, with your actions. Okay. Yeah. Oh. That is so rude. I'm so sorry. Listen, you have a free pass to be tired, all things considered. Oh, you know, it's been keeping me sane throughout the whole of this. I've been making myself a cocktail every night. So um, I was come back from work, sneak into the kitchen, make myself a really good cocktail, sanitise everything, drink it, and then it just knocks me out. Uh, you listen, you got to love a little ritual, right? I've actually become quite the mixologist now. Have you? Better with vodka, whiskey, and gin. Nice. So what's your favourite out of mm, Yes, lover. What actually would I make it? 
what would you make for me? Which one would I choose? I would definitely go with whiskey. And and don't say old fashioned. It ha it can't be an old fashioned. Everybody does that. How basic do you think I am as a mixologist? Okay, I'd make you a Worcester Ale, John Brewery, and Scotch whiskey. Because if you're a man already. That'll do the trick. I don't doubt it. Just even the sound of rusty nails <laughs> for a drink is incredible. Yeah, yeah. I think it lives up to its name. Well, trust me, that would be very gratefully received these days. Tina? Sorry. It's nearly 8pm, Tina. Time to go into that. Oh, sorry. It's nearly 8pm. I'm going to have to go outside and do the clap for the NHS. OK, likewise. I uh, hope you had a good time tonight. Yeah, I did. Thanks. And you too. Oh. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Okay, cool.